What's crackalackin' everybody and welcome back to what is probably the most epic unlisted leaf video I'm ever about to show you guys. So what, if your seatbelt is not done up, if you have not got your hard hat on, please go to the safety equipment shop, buy yourself a nice like bright coloured vest, a hard hat, because you could potentially die. Um, because what I'm about to show you may cause earthquakes, avalanches and uh, you know, the whole tsunami might like go over a continent. Because this thing is so epic. It is ridiculous. I think this is probably my new favorite Pokemon card ever. I, like, let alone in my very own Pokemon card collection. Uh, what am I talking about? It is this card right here. You guys might actually recognize it from uh, my top 10 most expensive cards in the world video. So it wasn't actually on the list, but it was on a potential list. Like, remember how I was like, and this card is coming out later in the year, and when it comes out, it will absolutely like, go skyrocket in the price. This is the card right here. This is what I'm talking about. Okay, so everyone take a deep breath. Let me know when you're ready. All right, we'll give you a couple seconds. Oh, yes, that's perfect. Oh my gosh, seriously, did you have to go to the bathroom in that smaller break? But anyway, guys, this is the card that I'm talking about. This is the legendary thing itself. I'll just spin it around right now. It is the 2014 Battle Fiesta promo Pikachu card. Uh, the full art edition, which is completely hand-drawn. We've got a mega Gengar on the front. We've got a flipping gangster-ass Pikachu. And check the, like, electricity coming out of his, like, cheeks there. We've also got that Sylveon jumping for joy. A Panchomp and Lucario. That is Cameo Central. That is, like, when the Simpsons and Futurama or Simpsons and Family Guy do crossovers. But, yeah, it's, like, so many cameos in one thing. And we've also got the 2014 Battle Fiesta logo down the bottom there. Um, we've got all the sort of attacks, which is a uh, 1, which is an 100 damage attack, which is so hashtag cray. We've also got this 60 HP attack there. I'll take it out of its top loader. Um, give me a second because I do not want to like damage this at all. Sorry about the guys, I actually took my time. I really don't want to damage this thing because I know it's actually going to skyrocket in price. Um, oh my gosh, like look at it down the bottom. So it's number 90, which is the 90 promo. And uh, I can't get over this. It's just the hand-drawn artwork that really does it for me. The amazing, incredible background it's got around there and the Battle Fiesta logo down there. But seriously, it's one of my favorite cards ever. And I just wanted to show you guys, let you know it's on eBay at the moment. So if you want to buy it, you can. On the back of it, it's a usual sort of uh, Japanese backing your card. So you're like, oh yeah, this is a normal card. Oh wait, I'm dead. No, it's an actual full art flipping hand-drawn card, which looks so incredible. Look at that sparkle. It is like, it's enough to knock someone out. It's so hashtag cray. Um, it's super duper shiny as well. And I've got it in this really robust sleeve. So that probably doesn't help at all. I really like the Omega Gengar artwork. Who's your favorite artwork on this car, by the way? Probably, I don't know, Pikachu or Gengar? What do you reckon? Probably Gengar. He looks pretty sweet. Even though Pikachu is firing lightning box out of his cheeks. Um, super duper awesome card. You guys can pause the video. We'll put this one at the back. But the seller didn't even stop there. He's like, Ando, you can have two. Furious Fist boost backs to open up uh, on your video. I'm like, no way, dude. You're an absolute legend. So without further ado, let's crack into these two boost packs. We got a flipping Heracross one. And fingers crossed... Could you imagine if we managed to pull even like an, I don't know, even a holo? I would be happy with a holo. There's a code here. Make sure if you do grab that code, leave a comment in the comment section below letting me know what you do get. But let's do this. We got a super scoop up. We got a flipping fossil researcher. A uh, Torchic there. We got a Pancham. Makuhitu's punching the air. We got a reverse plus all. And then a flipping, oh my gosh, it's a thunderous regular rare. That is what... I kind of, that's our flipping luck right now. We have got a full art promo card, which is absolutely ridiculous. And then we pulled a regular Red Thunderous, uh, which is so hashtag cray. Oh my gosh. Uh, we got Lightning Slam and Raging Thunder Punch, which is the two of the most gangster attacks ever. So we'll put this one to the side, and we got one more boost pack with Hood Launcher on the front. He's like doing some wrestling move, jumping off the top of the ring. Let's bust this one open. And we got Pancham. Did we start with Pan? No, we didn't. Oh, I thought we'd... we got two Panchams in a row. You know what is on a Pancham? The cameo on that artwork. We've got three from the back here, and hopefully the second boost pack contains good. We got a Tyrant here. We got a Battle Reporter as well. Combustion busting that plank of wood. Has anyone like actually gone to a karate class where you've had to like slice the plank of wood in half? I don't know. I've never. I did karate when I was a small kid, but I never had to like slice a uh, bit of thing. Oh my gosh! It's a regular rare Hypno. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, two regular. Should we open it? I think I've got another boost pack somewhere. Yep, here we go. Look, I oh my gosh. My brother got this uh, got this for me the other day. I think we're just going to open it now. <laughs> I'm in the mood for opening boost packs, people. We got a flash fire. Oh, let's get this one. Crank it open. And uh, there's the flash fire code. And the very last... But we didn't shake it up. Can we still do it? Can we still shake it up once the card trick's done? All right, well, why not? Here we go. Shake it up, blow it for me. 
Let's do it. The final boost pack of this epic video. We got a floating flower monster of doom. We've also got the uh, startling megaphone. We got a Gumi as well. Caterpie who looks like, you know, you just let one go because it's pretty green around the area. You know, we're not pointing fingers, but if we did, we'd point at him. We've got a reverse shift tree here. And the final card is a hollow pyro. So that's not bad. That's actually a perfect way to finish this uh, opening off with a uh, really gangster hollow pyro, which we'll put at the back. But guys, the main thing of this video, the main reason why I wanted to make this video is just to show off this incredible card. I don't usually like do videos where I show one individual card because I think they're kind of boring. But hopefully you guys did, did uh, like this small little video because I can't get over this right now. It is such an incredible card. Like, everything about it. You can just stare at it for ages. It puts people to sleep. You know, they did sort of studies on this. When you look at it, you fall asleep instantly. Uh, in my case, you have a heart attack and die instantly. But, uh, yeah, this is such an incredible card. Make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. What do you think of it? Is it the most beautiful thing you've ever seen in the world? But, uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it here, guys. Uh, make sure you have a fantastic day. But most of all, what do you do? I don't, I don't know. Keep looking at this card, but make sure you keep on gaming. See you then, guys.